girls day out hair, makeup, and outfit. I really want to do a type of video that's like a completed look, and I was going to do one just for summer in general, but I already did a summer makeup routine, so then I just have to like do the same one, so it'd basically be like you guys watching the same video twice. So I decided to just think of another thing to do that has to do with the summer, which is hanging out with your friends during the summer. And yeah, so I really hope you guys enjoy this video. I am only one subscriber away from makeup collection, so if you'd like to see one, please subscribe. I got a new vanity, which you'll kind of see in the um, video. Throughout the video, you'll kind of see like clips of the vanity randomly. But anyway, I really hope you guys enjoy. Please ignore the really annoying ambulance siren behind me because ambulances are Anyways, I hope you guys really enjoy, and sorry my voice is a little bit nasally. I was sick from Wednesday to Sunday, which is why I didn't do any videos. But anyway, along with the rambling intro, I have a rambling video, so I hope you guys enjoy. Bye! So starting out with the makeup, I'm taking my primer, which is the Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser. And I love using this. It gives you such a nice, like, clean base for your foundation or BB cream. And I'm just blending this in with my fingers. Next, taking my Maybelline Dream Fresh BB Cream and a Sedona Lace Duo Fiber Brush. I'm just buffing this into my skin to give my skin some coverage, to moisturize it a little bit, and overall just to give my face a flawless finish. Next, I'm taking my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. You guys know I love this stuff. And I'm just placing this under my scary dark circles and blending it out with a beauty blender and my finger a bit, just to get anything the beauty blender missed. Next, I'm putting some on two little spots I have and just blending that out with the Beauty Blender and setting this with a translucent powder. This is Rimmel Stay Matte and I'm just putting this where I put concealer. And then I'm taking a big fluffy brush from Sedona Lace and just putting this all over my face to set everything and make sure that it is not going anywhere all day. Next, I'm contouring with NARS Laguna Bronzer and just placing this in my cheekbones just to give me a nice glow and a sunkissed look for the summer. And then taking Bobbi Brown Desert Rose Blush and putting this on the apples of my cheeks. Priming my eyes with the NARS Primer and just blending this out with my fingers. And from the Naked 3 palette, I'm taking Strange and using it as my base color. Next, I'm putting Limit in my crease, which is this really pretty pinky lavender color. And I'm just blending this out in the outer corner and the outer V, and then gradually bringing it up into my crease. This gives the eyeshadow some depth. Next, I'm taking Dust and putting this on the inner half of my lid and putting Strange on my inner corners to highlight and I'm also putting it on my brow bone to highlight. Next, I'm lining my eyes with Naked 3 Black Heart, which is such a pretty color. It's like a matte black, but it has red shimmers in it, hence the name Black Heart, and I just love it so much and I love the look it gives and especially with this eye look then I'm taking a Too Faced mascara and just gradually putting a lot on my lashes I must say it's a lot of coats but trying to give my lashes a voluminous effect then I'm putting on One Size Fits Pearl by Maybelline which is a color whisper lipstick and that's the completed makeup look um, yeah it's pretty simple and I can't even take myself seriously in these pictures but yeah that's it Now it's hair time and we're just going to brush out our hair to get all those knots out because we don't want any curly knots because that will just not look good. So um, once I've done that, I'm just separating my hair by putting a hair tie over one half, so just kind of sectioning it off, I guess you could say. I'm using my Remington T-Studio Curling Wand, half an inch to an inch. I love it so much. And I'm just wrapping the hair around the curling wand and then waiting about 10 seconds and just putting it in the palm of my hand to make sure the curl lasts. So I'm just curling it, letting it drop in my hand. And this is the last piece I'm going to show you because I feel this is pretty self-explanatory. Now I'm just doing this to the rest of my head. Those are my curls and I just mess them up a bit, give them a little bit more volume. Now it's time for my outfit and I love this outfit, it's super girly. So this is the outfit and my t-shirt is from Brandy Melville. I love it so much. It's so mean, it's so girly. 
and my skirt is from Urban Outfitters. It's so flowy. It's just a black floral pattern. Then my Oxfords, you guys know I love these. These are from H&M and they're so freaking cute. And then I have my purse, which is a faux Cambridge bag and that's from H&M as well. And my headband is from Primark and that is the completed outfit. I love you guys so much and I hope you enjoyed. Bye!